There have been three pools at, here at TAM. The first pool was made in 1924. The students raised $4,500 in a week for the well, pool. Well, it was in the old gym, which was across the highway that went through TAM, close to the railroad tracks. And I rem it was indoors. No, not that I... Well, you know, for the, the boys' swim team... Sometimes then you could go and cheer them on type of thing. Mm. But, um, and I don't remember a place where you could even really sit. There must have been some kind of structure. You know, there must have been maybe a little bit of bleachers or something. I don't, it was small. You know, it was not a place where you, you, mm. you just swam, that's all. Mm -hmm. In 1957, the original pool was condemned as unsafe and closed. This outdoor pool opened in 1958. This pool was about four feet deep and had a smaller diving pool next to what is now known as the boys' locker room. In 2006, it was decided that the TAM District Schools, TAM, Drake, and Redwood would undergo renovations. This included remodeling the pools. It was estimated that all three would cost about $3.5 million, meaning our TAM pool would cost around $1.7 million. A total of $1,695,500 difference from the cost of our first TAM pool. Now along with Tamalpais High School, the pool is also used by Soma Aquatics and the Strawberry Seals Marin Swim League team. Um, I think that it's a great environment for kids and it brings the school together as a community and it allows people to get to know each other and build relationships that they wouldn't otherwise. The TAM pool is a place where people come together to form teams and to create relationships they otherwise wouldn't have. The people that come here create a community by sharing wins and losses together and just in the simplicity of sharing a love for being in the water. The TAM pool is a great environment for this. It's large and well equipped, and we are lucky to have a place that forms such a community. Every day of my life, I'm there. <laughs> busted into the pool.